My boys, we made it. Okay, we didn't make it. There ain't shit here. Come on, I was expecting gold. You know, a throne to be sitting on. Dr. Mr. Farrell? Wait, wait, wait. 350,000. That's hundreds of years ago. What's going on? Alright, hold up. There's nothing here? Alright, nothing. Alright, cool. Cool. Nothing? Alright. There we go. I was about. No, where are you going? There we go. I didn't want to just drop all the way down. Don't know what the fuck is down here. Yo, can can we find like some new gear, new technology? Right, there doesn't seem to be anything here until we go forward, I guess. So I thought I heard something, but it's just my imagination. All right, so we're down here in this uh, bunker. I assume this what it is, or facility, underground facility. Deathbringer, or a statue of one, anyway. A machine built to kill, and they honored it. Welcome to Feral Automated Solutions, where all the problems of tomorrow are being solved today. With over 25,000 human employees based in nations and corporate holdings across the globe. Pharaoh leads the world in every sector of self-sustaining, fully automated technology. That's nice to know, you know, uh, civilization was way advanced compared to how it is now. A group of people not unlike a tribe. And they made machines. Yeah, go on. I've uploaded some data files to your focus. They'll help you understand. Oh, it's just the history of it. No, I'm not gonna read all that. As cool as it is, you know, I'm not. I'm not gonna read all that. This kind of looks like some Dead Space. Uh, was it uh, workbench crafting stuff? Dead Space Three, at least, you know. We gotta show up to this meeting, bro. We're so freaking late. Yo, what's this? Metal shard, metal shard, ridgewood. Okay, I'll take all that. I should. Can't craft anything, huh? Resist potion range for elemental resistance traps. Oh, I don't really care for traps. There's no smell to it. Not even old death. Nothing natural. The fuck? Oh. Alright. Just keep going. Another cave in. But I could get through. Oh shit! <sighs> Bro. That was so unexpected right there. <laughs> I bet I can use that as a ramp to get back up. I hope so. Alright, so we climb up this fucking ladder, right? Okay. Cool. Good to know. Hmm. Am I just like a fucking idiot? Just don't know how to fucking do this? Hmm. We climb up here, right? Right. Now, how do we get across? Drop to the ledge? No. There's no fucking way. There's no fucking way I can... She couldn't even jump across, man. That's...
Wow. How the hell am I supposed to know shit like this? How the hell am I supposed to know that she could, like, climb like that, man? I mean, I know she can, but, like... Like, dude, come on. I'd have to ditch something. Shut up. Uh... Take the whole fucking shit. Alright, so... Now that we're here... Shard salvage skill allows you to... Oh, bitch. Th these type of moments in this fucking game are just like why I just can't... Play these type of games when they do shit like this. It's like, bro, I can't... I can't even really look up. I can't... They gave us this pathway for what? Okay, see? Now that's what I'm talking about. It didn't even fucking let me jump that way. And I'm not jumping or nothing. It's, she's fucking jumping. Fucking A. Looks like the way up. What's left of it? You know, I I need I definitely need a loot. If possible. What the fuck is all this? Boring. This place for something. Something bad. Let's go. See, like, she just starts climbing shit with, like, and I don't even know what the hell she could climb. At least make it a little obvious. Like, bro, what the fuck? Yeah, obvious like what we can climb. That's what I'm saying. If plants can find a way to hang on up here, I guess I can too. Like, bro, I I'm pushing up the whole time, and she's just climbing left and right. Okay, that time I had to move to the left, but still, like, look, I didn't do that. I'm still pushing up. Uh, oh, you're getting cold? Well, maybe you should have just fucking wore a jacket. What is this? Since the began when they engaged in unauthorized offensive operations against robots and human personnel of the Hearts Team or Energy Combine. Now, I wish that I could relate that the crisis has been... Exaggerated, but the fuck stopped me. The peacekeepers have not responded to stand down coats, and by all signs, they appear to be replicating at a precipitous rate. Now, what I can promise you, can absolutely assure you, is that I am already devoting every possible resource towards reaching a speedy conclusion to this issue. So, when you hear the bad talk about us against this company in the days, maybe weeks to come. Just bear in mind that we will get past this. That a day's coming when none of this will matter. Peacekeepers. That's what they called their machines. They were built for war, not peace. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Am I supposed to just... Alright, it looks like I gotta jump to that. Fuck! Was that? Let's fucking climb up these. Like, bro, how am I supposed to know I could climb up those? And that they were right there. I thought I had to walk up there. They fucking led me down a false path. Like, they don't say, oh, you could climb up these type of things. You could climb up those type of things. No. They just give you different shit that you climb on. Last time it was like electric boxes. Now if I saw those, then yeah, I definitely think that I'll be able to climb. Wow. Really? Took you that long? What the f- Okay, I've, I've kind of had it. 
I can't, oh, yep. God damn it. I let go. I didn't, I didn't keep moving forward. I stopped. Think I could make it? The fuck was the point of that? I'm pretty sure she could have made that, man. It's right here. What's right here? Forget about traveling light. Rock ammo? I don't think I need rock ammo. Well, she jumps high for what? She jumps high for what? I don't even know what we're coming up here for. No, I can't climb up that. Well, wow. who would have guessed? Mm. Oh my god. Yep. That was a long ass drop. Like I, I thought she would have died a lot faster than. The way up. Oh, there we go. Few good handholds. Wow, she Found barely it. made it. Made it. Wonder what we'll find. The hell's this? All data has been erased from this device. Do you wish to deploy our privileges to recover purge data? Oh yes, I believe I do. A file has been recovered. A file has been recovered, huh? Elizabeth, good to, uh... Oh, shit. It's been years. Where's your legal team, Ted? No need. I dropped all 18 lawsuits the moment you landed. I assume your daddy confirms us. These are her parents? This to be interesting. Perhaps we could have lunch brought in. You know, get reacquainted. I know you, Ted. You screwed something up, something big, or you wouldn't have eaten the crow necessary to get me here. So, spit it out. There's a glitch in the chariot line. Your killer robots? Peacekeepers, yes. Those. So shut them down. <laughs> Obviously, Liz, we would, if we could. They're not responding. Are you telling me a swarm has gone rogue, Ted? So you tell me that chariot has been sitting there that whole time. That same way. Show me the data then. And we'll take that lunch. Alone. Ted Faro brought Elizabeth Sobek here, but they hated each other. Wow. Another file has been recovered. Another file has been recovered. This isn't a glitch. It's a catastrophe. Bro, why is that shit stopping me? It's bad. Bad? Jesus, Liz. It's not bad, Ted. It's apocalyptic. You built a line of killer robots. Peacekeepers. That consume biomass as fuel. In emergencies. And you made them capable of self-replication. Limited, self-manufacture, controlled. Who's she? Why'd she, why'd she look over here? <laughs> the only nation this swarm answers to now is itself. You, you think Everything that, else I... is just food. And at the rate it's replicating, Ted, it will strip the Earth bare in 15 months. We're not talking fall of civilization. We're talking extinction. I get it, Liz. So how do I stop it while it's contained? It's not contained. It can't be. You know what I mean. Right. Before the truth gets out, you mean. Liz, I will do anything you say. Keep working it, and whatever you recommend, I'll do. I'm gonna hold you to that, Ted. Robots 
threatened all life on Earth. But somehow she defeated them. The world of the old ones fell, but life went on, or, or we wouldn't be here. Another file. Oh, okay. Project Zero Dawn. Jesus, Liz. There has to be another way. If there were a nicer way to fix your mess, I would have proposed it. But this? This? Why is she just like in the middle of the when table? I asked you to find a cure, I didn't expect it to be worse than the disease. It's not, Ted. It may be grim. But it's our only chance. Is she Next like somewhere else and he she's just speaking to him it, through I like a communicator? That. Yes, you can. That? Liz, I cannot in good conscience sign that. You've got a choice, Ted. I know. I am speaking to you from a VTOL en route to US Robot Command. Oh yep. A VTOL? In fifteen minutes, I meet with General Harris and the rest of the Joint Chiefs. What? what? Are you crazy? Now your choice is what I can tell them. Sign, and I'll tell them the wealthiest corporation on Earth has guaranteed the funds necessary to build Zero Dawn. Exactly as I've designed it. Or don't sign, and I will make sure they and everyone else on this planet knows the real cause of the glitch. Jesus, Liz. You don't have to threaten me. I'll sign. What, you, what the fuck are you talking about? You didn't even want to sign it. Look on the so what do you think she Ted. had to do? From here on out, you get to do what you've always been good at. Footing the bill while others Why she, get their hands dirty. Why does she keep looking over here? God forgive me. Who are you looking at? Is that it? What made her solution so terrible? What did she do to stop the robots? Executive access detected. Express lift opened. This, this doesn't add up. Sobek couldn't have been my mother. She lived ages ago. All this searching and I'm still no closer. Is that your reaction to everything you've just learned? To whine like a spoiled child? You should really try talking that way to me face to face. As you wish. Do you really have no idea how monumental are the discoveries you just made, Aloy? I expected more of you. So, you have a face. Got a name to go with it? Of all the questions you could ask right now, that's the one you choose. I've spent decades searching the ruins of the old ones, trying to solve the mystery of what happened to them. For years, I've suspected oh, yeah? that robots destroyed their civilization, but I could never confirm it. And in minutes, oh, really? you uncover more ancient knowledge than I have in a lifetime. And what you want to know is my name. Obviously, Silence. we just asked. That's my name. Silence? Why don't you try asking another question? Something less trivial. Hmm. All right, Silence, you've made your point. I came to these ruins hoping to learn more about this Elizabeth Sobek. And I have, but I still don't understand my connection to her. Or why the Eclipse is trying to kill me. Or who Hades is. No answers, just one question after another. Exactly. Which is why it's time to expand your frame of inquiry. Only then will you see just how big your problems really are. What exactly are you talking about? Yeah, what is it? You what is he talking about? A personal riddle into a crowd of larger mysteries. The common thread is your connection to Elizabeth Subic. But what is that connection? She couldn't have been my mother if she lived centuries ago. She's a clone. Don't know the connection yet. The only way to find out is to keep going, to keep making discoveries. That's gonna, that's gonna be the twist. We She's a clone. We now learned that Pharaoh robots once threatened to end life on Earth. But it didn't happen. The old one civilization was destroyed, but life, life was saved. Obviously. So, what did Elizabeth do? 
How did she stop the robots before all was lost? Uh. Project Zero Dawn. Hmm. Exactly the question. Now, are you ready to go get the answer? Of course I am. Hell yeah. You're still standing here. Bro, get out of my face. You're insufferable, you know that? Let's get on with this. Elizabeth told Ted Faro she was headed for a place called U.S. Robot Command to tell people about Zero Dawn. The place still exists as a ruin. The Asaram call it the Grave Horde. Grave Horde. Grave Horde. Cheery name. It, yeah. You'll find it in the eastern mountains, buried under the tangled coils of a metal devil or a BOR-7 Horus, rather, as we're learning to call them. Oh, uh, is that a bird? I can't wait. Someday we'll meet in person. And we'll All right. All right, well, that's going to do it for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, be yeah, sure to hit that like down button down and subscribe if you down haven't down already. US robot command next. Trophy earned. Learn of the ancient past. And, you know, share it, comment. It really helps me out. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.